going to work. Just, I'm going to go to some meetings. Going to go to a board meeting and take a couple calls, do some email, and go out to lunch. I mean, <laughs> hey, everybody, welcome back to my world, where no matter how old you get, you never need to grow up. And I know that I said that I was only buying these two Barbie The Looks dolls from the new Color Block series, but I forgot that I had lied. Well, I mean, is it lying if you don't remember that perhaps one night, maybe drunk scrolling Mattel creations. <laughs> I don't, I honestly don't remember, but I love her. So this is uh, the Barbie Looks doll uh, from uh, Mattel Creations website. She might be on Amazon, I'll look. Uh, it, she doesn't appear to have a number and um, she is kind of surprisingly, she's only $30, but she comes with a second outfit and it appears that she's fully articulated. So I'm confused, uh, but happy because of all of them from an outfit perspective, I really like her the most. So I am going to get this beauty out of the box and we're gonna take a closer look at the Barbie signature looks doll. She's out of the box and she's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Now, it's interesting because uh, I would never, uh, you know, I'm not real good with color. Just let me say that from the get-go, especially in terms of like what colors go together to wear them. I would never have thought, hey, you know what would go really good together? Some hot pink silk and some shiny satin turquoise or teal. I guess it's kind of teal. I would never ever ever have thought that yet look at it it's gorgeous she's gorgeous her face sculpt as we know i never know the names of the barbie sculpts but wow and i love that bold lip i love bangs by the way i mean i just think bangs really frame eyes and faces really nicely i think they draw attention to your eyes I'm a big fan of bangs. And her hair is like super straight. I mean, it's a very, very simple, straight cut. It feels like it's got like a little bit of product in it to keep it straight. But I do appreciate that because it was in there with thread um, and not held down by plastic, it didn't get the crimp marks in it too badly. So I really like that. Um, it's a little fuzzy, but you know, it's like anybody else who has their hair, you know, you keratin treatment to your hair and then it's starting to wear off, you know? Um, wow. She is on uh, a made to move body, just like the other Barbie looks dolls, which is amazing to me. I mean, really, oh, really good. Look at her. She looks like she's like, mm, should she really be talking about me? I'm not feeling it. Mm, this lady has no fashion sense. She's judging me. Uh, you know, so the whole the whole thing, elbows, hands, waist, knees, ankles. Oh, and she's got plastic under here to keep, I just realized I was like, what is that strange noise to keep her pants the color from transferring to her legs, which I appreciate. And then she's got these pink shoes. She comes with this funky clutch and then these really cool, and I was really excited. She came with three of the, hello camera. Hi, sorry. Anytime now camera, anytime. So she's got these big chunky gold bangles and she's got three of them. So that's kind of nice. Um, and then her other outfit, which I'm gonna put her in in a second is this like shockingly like, like electric lemon dress with, with teal shoes and so I mean the mix and match is is really cool here and I I think I'm still like so this was thirty dollars wow I'm really excited about that I'm gonna change her outfit and we'll be right back okay so I'm thinking second outfit is the keeper for me this yellow is woo wow I mean look at her she looks like she is just ready to like walk into a boardroom on a TV show because like nobody in real life wears this to a boardroom. But like, doesn't she look like she's ready to just drop like the info on them, like give them the big download on how they're a bunch of chuckleheads and take over the company or solve the case or whatever. She looks 
amazing. Hey, total segue for a second. Speaking of really good shows where that kind of outfit happens, I just watched, I watched it in one day. I think it's on Amazon Prime. Uh, it's called Riches, and it's this this story about this uh, Nigerian immigrant family in England, and they started this whole uh, black-owned hair care and and wig and and extensions company, and it's like huge, and it was like, I mean, I love shows. Okay, so this is weird. I really like shows with beautiful rich people in really nice clothes. It's like, I don't know, that's escapism for me because it's totally like not my life. And I just, I, I'm, I, and it was a good story too. It was a really, really good story. It was a really interesting perspective. And I mean, it's just like one gorgeous person in a gorgeous outfit after another. It was so, I was just like watching everybody's wigs change. And I was like, oh damn. I mean, it was, it's a really great story, but Every single time um, the main character, Nina, like, you know, had another outfit on and walked into the office, I looked at my husband. And I was like, yeah, because that's what a CEO wears to work. You know, I mean, it was like stuff like this. <laughs> just like, you know, you're just going to work. Just eh, I'm going to go go to some meetings, going to go to a board meeting and eh, take a couple calls, do some email and eh, go out to lunch. I mean, it's just anyway, um, I think this outfit is gorgeous and her clutch is now on the floor because hashtag so profesh. It's two pieces, so you know, you can totally mix and match, which is the point of this, like that you can have over a hundred looks somehow. Other thing that I thought was really cool is that that pink shirt is actually a bodysuit, and I love these little elastic poof sleeves. And that is a really cool thing because, and while we chat, I'm just gonna change and put the blue pants on. Um, you, you know, for a long time, I did not understand why people could tuck shirts into their jeans and those shirts stayed perfectly tucked. They never moved. Everything looked great. And then I discovered bodysuits. And I was like, oh, and I was like, you know what? My mom used to put these on me when I was a kid and they were such a huge pain in the ass because I could never get them snapped shut again, you know? Um, but that is, uh, that is a secret there about how you get them to look like that. And uh, it's a good secret and it works. I think parents, grandparents, aunts, uncles, cool people who buy dolls for kids and themselves. This is a great set. I mean, she's a gorgeous, gorgeous, fully posable doll with some really fun accessories. You got sunglasses, you got two pairs of shoes, you got a clutch, you got the gold bangle bracelets here. And you've got these really kind of high fashion pieces of clothing. I mean, look, and it all works together. See, I even, look, I did a thing. I used all three colors. I'm very proud of myself. I, and, I, and, and she's gorgeous. I mean, look at her. Look at how her lips pop with the yellow versus they were a little more subdued looking when she had the pink shirt close to her face. I mean, oof. Maybe I'm going to keep her in this. Ooh, I think I'm keeping her in this. I think so. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. I know I've been a little MIA. Life, life keeps happening. What can I say? Uh, but I felt like I got her and I was like, I have to show her to everybody. So thank you so much for watching, everybody. I will see you again real soon. Let me know down below in the comments what you think of this Barbie look doll. See you again soon. Bye.